Hello, um, I've had a lot of people asking if I could do a tutorial for this song, uh, the Joker, Steve Miller band. Um, it basically, it's really just a riff that you need to learn for this one. Uh, it's one of those classic, you know, three chord songs, G, D, C, although I tend to play C at nine rather than C, but um, they're, they're the only chords in the song, three chords. Um, and if you want to see Steve Miller playing this one acoustically, you can. There's a version of him uh, on YouTube. If you just go to YouTube and look up Steve Miller, The Joker, Unplugged, you'll find um, him sitting in some recording studio playing this one. I think it's a Bob Rivers show where you can clearly see how he's playing it. I think he has his guitar tuned down, um, but he's playing G, C, and D. Um, but I'll show you what I think he's doing, basically. Um, that's all the riff is. So make a G. Now, as I said, he's playing C, but I'm gonna play C at nine, so I just find the transition easier. So it's just a little, basically getting those little riffs between the chords on these bass notes. So at, now, as you know, going from a G to a C at nine just involves moving these two fingers off the sixth and fifth strings down to the fourth and fifth strings. Okay. But what he's doing is basically really attacking the strings and doing down, two downs, down, down. And then he opens up the fifth string and hammers onto the second. So down, down, strum, open fifth, hammer on, and then same on the C at nine now. Down, down on the fifth string. Open fourth and hammer onto the fourth on the second. So then down, down now on the fourth string, which is the D. Run up the fifth now, back to the C add, C add nine. Open the fourth again and hammer on, then play the third open. He doesn't necessarily play those strings so strictly in that in that particular order every time, but if you do, you won't go too much wrong. Obviously, um, when you start playing it and get into it, you're just going to be a bit more untidy. Some people call me the Space Power Boy. Yeah. so precise with exactly hitting the right strings it's more or less just getting the feel getting the groove kind of happening some, and if you want to play C some people call me the space cowboy just doing that through the whole song till you get to the chorus um, you're just gonna go from G to C G to C for a little while cuz I'm a picker I'm a grinner I'm a lover and I'm a sinner but it's pretty much all just doing that hammer on on the second fret of each of those chords cuz I'm a picker I'm a grinner I'm a lover and I'm a sinner playing my music As the strum, I'm using the inside of my palm um, to, to mute the down strokes. Okay, uh, I know I'm rushing through this, and for those of you who don't know about palm muting and stuff like that, you might find this a bit um, tricky, but 
Anyway, for um, everybody else, uh, that's basically all you need uh, to figure out this song. It's just getting that little riff happening um, with those little transitions in between each of those chords. So anyway, I don't know that there's too much more I can show you um, for the Joker. Uh, anyway, that's all I'm doing. That's all Steve's doing as well. So. Anyway, that'll do. Bye.